All right, here we are. So let's launch our stuff and then I'm going to play with the. Um, so I love to use the render view instead of the because we have all of this control already. And let's change. Ah, okay, now now it's great. So maybe we could use some. Um, so here, yeah, about the um, the ACs. So if you use ACs, you can see it's see unturn. This is without. This is with ACs. And it looks better, I think, already. But maybe I'm partial to this. But it's um, it's interesting to have uh, to have this. And also in my case, uh, well, I don't know if I'm. No, I'm go not going to, uh, to to show it. And so maybe we could use. I would like to to play a bit with the. So I'm going to take again uh, the sun, uh, which is right here. I'm going to move it up. And okay, so this is the Z. I'm orientating like that. Okay, now I would like to to make some kind of sunset. So it's different mood, but let's uh, let's try. All right, so here it is. And now, Ooh, nice. yeah, nice. Enough, yeah, with the sun, I can try to use. Uh, I have interface. Okay, so here with the sun, what we can try to use is uh, on the, okay, now it's on the sky, it's a bit confusing. So on the sky here, we can increase the sun scale. So it has nice thing like that. And oh, now right. the bloom <laughs> and the tree, and maybe you can have a stronger streak like that. So it's it's all very no interesting. Thing. <laughs> it's just no, now we did like one hour. <laughs> yeah, so yes. sure, why not? We did one hour of sharing the screen and so on. And if we just um, left it all at uh, Lionel's side, uh, it would have looked like this within the first ten minutes. <laughs> yeah, ten minutes. <laughs> yeah. Well, not today. He's been very uh, very calm and patient with us. So yeah. at the very beginning, I had no idea what to do. So I was a bit in a panic. And you had, with the turbidity, if we increase it, it's going to be even redder. And you can see here the ACs are, is doing wonder, I think. I love it because what was previously just blown out is much more smooth, yes. natural. Yeah. And then what is blown out just feels I'm, right. Yeah, I'm a bit surprised. The untone is is good, but it's yeah, it's blown out, like you said. And this one is is you see, it's more natural. We have some very gentle highlighter. And what I can do now is go to the sun and increase the sun intensity. So it's just going to be harder. And yeah, maybe I'm going to show this very quickly. If I go to the red shift in the, uh, so that's something um, I want to, to, uh, to give the credit to, where is it? Yeah, the globals. In the credits here, you can use some color open your uh, color configuration. And I have some in my R, ah, where is it? It's uh, some OCO config that uh, Sol Espinoza from Redshift uh, have created for uh, for all. And yeah, here it is. Huh? So now I have those ones. So this is the one with the, um, the color contrast uh, that I love. Uh, I showed you one of the webinar. Uh, it's going to add the filmic curve on top of it. So it's still ACs, but with filmic curve. And here using high contrast, we have even nicer rhythm result, I think. So yeah, the very high contrast is too too high, but you can see yeah. uh, the idea we have, we can go the other way also. So this is very nice. And something we can include, I think, in the file. And again, uh, give credit to, to Sol because he's the one who did that. <laughs> 